let's look into share object repository suppose you are designing two test test 1 and test 2 each having three actions all actions use a common object if properties of that object change you will have to individually make changes in the object repositories of all six actions this could be a very time consuming task considering that you can have even more tests and actions using the same object the solution use global object repository which can be shared across all actions of all the tests shared object repositories are preferable when application is dynamic and object description change frequently use in most automation projects need maintenance and administration since any action can update the shared object repository an accidental change in object description can cause all tests to fail usually in automation projects engineers are given a read only access to the object repository and changes have to be requested to object repository controller who has complete control over the repository now let's look into the three main steps involved in shared object repository step number 1 creating a shared object repository step number 2 associating a shared object repository editing a shared object repository let's look into them one by one you are aware that all repositories are local by default so you need to create a shared object repository to create a shared object repository in the object repository dialog box click on file export local objects repository files are stored with an extension .tsr give a suitable name to the repository say guru99.com click save button the repository file is created next step is to associate the repository to your test to enable you to use it to associate repository with a test click resources associate repository select the repository to be associated qtp will display a list of all available actions in the script select the actions you want to associate your repository with you can have multiple repositories associated with the same action click okay button the repositories are now associated and you can use the shared repository to develop your test if you open object repository you will notice that the shared object repositories are in read only mode you cannot edit a shared object using object repository you will have to use the object repository manager to edit a shared object repository select resources object repository manager open the object repository we created guru99.com by default repository is open in read only mode to enable editing click file enable editing once editing is enabled you can do all the operations like cut copy paste rename etc that you can do in object repository what is unique with object repository manager is you can compare two object repositories select tools object repository comp comparison tool select the two repository files that you wish to compare qtp will give you a statistics of what's unique and common in both the repositories
also if required you can use the object repository merge tool to merge two repositories you need to specify the location of the two repository files click ok QTP will help you resolve conflicts present if any while merger Once conflicts are resolved, you can save the repository under a new name. That's all to share object repository.